Hey, what's going on YouTube? This is Dottie with Ignite Cinemas, and today I'm gonna be doing a live unboxing, testing, and review of this bad boy right here. The new parrot teleprompter called the Padcaster. Let's get it! So yes, I ordered this teleprompter because, you know, I'm doing a lot of videos and I used a teleprompter in the past, but it recently broke and me and my friend were actually sharing it, but that thing was super, super bulky and, you know, I was in the market for a new teleprompter, especially for some of my clients where they can't rememorize a script and I wanted something that's easy to use, low key, portable, and this popped up and I think it came out like a few months ago, but I've heard some incredible things about this and for the hundred, well I paid 140, $150 or so on Amazon, I figure I give it a chance and I will be testing it tomorrow during a video shoot that I'm doing for one of my clients. So I will be given a live test. But before that, I wanted to do an official unboxing with you guys. So let's jump into the unboxing right now. Okay, so here is the official unboxing of the Parrot Teleprompter Hat Caster. The instructions. I don't know what this is. Oh, okay. What is this? Hold on. Oh, cool. You get a cleaning kit for your lenses. Oh, I love these. You get one of those microfiber cleaners. Hey, this is clutch because I got glasses. This thing's like a quilt. Shoot. It's like a mink. Way better than the small one I had. So I'll be using this for my glasses. That's cool. That comes included. Cleaning kit. So it's a cleaning kit. Cool. You also get the remote. I got the version with the remote because it makes the most sense. It is Bluetooth, especially when I'm controlling. That's handy. You also get, this is the actual pad caster right here. There's the glass. Hey y'all, I see y'all. <laughs> this is used to protect it, but look how small this is. This is awesome. This is awesome. Small and compact. The one I've used in the past has been very bulky. It's not ideal. And then these right here, sorry, these right here are, I think the lens adjustments. Yes. There's a lot of them in here actually. Oh. Come on, Mo. Oh, there we go. So these are the rings to fit every type of lens. From 37 millimeter, 46. You get the main gist. All right. And that's all that comes in this box. It is so important to make sure your health, okay, so. It is so important. All right, we're gonna speed this up. It is so important to make sure. It is so important to make sure your health is a priority. If you have any of the above risk factors and are over the age of 40, please make a screening for breast cancer your priority this month. God damn it. Please make a screening for breast cancer this month. Why is that part don't? When you, so right now I'm showing you guys how to put this on. I'm using, I'm filming with my GH5 and I'm using my handy dandy Canon 7D Mark II. So I'm gonna show you how to do this. I'm gonna show you how to do this, son. Remember that Jay Z song? Y'all not hip? All right, check it out. 
So in this case, I'm using the Sigma Art Lens 18 to 35, and this is uh, let me show you. This is a 72. Um, you guys can see it right there. It has a circle with dash, and it tells you the number 72. That's the ring holder we want. Okay. Now what I've noticed when I use this, I also have a lens protector, of course. So to protect my lens I've had trouble installing this onto there so I had to take this off um, drop in the comments if you experience the same thing so I do have to sacrifice that but we got we got our ring holder and what this does is it hooks up to the back of this telepomp and it connects accordingly now what I do is I, I attach it to the teleprompt holder thingy right here and I just screw in. Screw it up. Yep, I screw it in as so. And voila, there we have it. There we have it. There we go. And then what you do is knock this bad boy down. It's like so. And then we put our phone on there. So like I said, I'm a big fan of this Parrot, um, not the Parrot app, I think that's trash, but Prompt Smart Pro, you guys can go in your app store, I'm gonna show you where it's at. So type in Prompt Smart in the app store or whatever store you got. You know I'm rocking team iPhone, so you know how we coming. And you definitely wanna pay the $20 for the Pro version because if you do so, you get the baller voice recognition. And then um, what you do is, Put it like that. Look at that. Boom. Stop texting me. Boom. Hit play. And you get that voice recognition. Look how good that looks right there. Let me show you what we got going on. Look how good that looks right there. Can you see that? Can you see how good that looks? This is awesome. That is a little quick rundown on how this bad boy works. So update, it's been about two weeks and I've been able to test this amazing teleprompter Not only with myself. Hey, it's Jamie and in this video I'm going to be revealing five keys to hiring a videographer So you can get the best videographer from the gate and not deal with people who are going to waste your time But I've also been able to use it with many projects I've done with my clients and they all love it. It's made our job so much easier and it gave them more confidence because they didn't have to remember their lines. They could simply look at the screen right here and say everything and you wouldn't see their eyes move. It makes it a lot easier when you get to read off of that thing. Hi, I'm Steve Kaplanaris. At Rock and Eastern staff, we're all about our local community, supporting veterans, and as many local causes as we can. And when you're in the market for a newer pre-owned vehicle, come see us at Rock and Eastern Stafford. And this is a big upgrade for me because when I used to do sales videos and thank you pages and anything with a script, I would do this. Let me show you. I would literally <laughs> write everything and then memorize it and then post this like underneath the camera. It got the job done, but who has time for that? Like if you have to, okay, we get it, but the investment in this teleprompter has made everything phenomenal. And one thing I also wanna um, point out when using this teleprompter, you know, they're gonna tell you you get the Parrot teleprompter app. This is trash, this is whack. Like pay the extra $20. I'm gonna tell you straight up, pay the extra $20 because you won't look like a jabroni on set trying to go through and you have your you have your client or whoever's reading it and then you have to use the button to manually scroll up. Scroll up, no, get rid of that headache, look like a boss and purchase, um, I'm on iPhone, but it's called Prompt, Prompt Smart Pro. The only thing that's um, been weird sometimes is like, and I think this has to do with within the app is that when some of some of the clients I had who were reading from it the scroll and how it scrolled it would randomly stop and I think that's because maybe they're a little bit soft-spoken because you definitely want to project your voice so it can follow and track where you're supposed to go I believe that's what it said it's not moving it's okay 
I'll do that part, that little dot again. The, but, start, the starting. Yeah. But that only happened like on two occasions. All the other times I've worked with people, um, it has worked phenomenal, including myself. I think I encountered that problem once. But then again, I, I'm a little stuffed up from allergies, so that might have been it too. Another thing too, it is small. So like if your eyesight is not good and you need glasses, you will get exposed. I had a lot of my friends, business owner friends, um, a little bit struggling, you know, and I would struggle too if I didn't have these glasses because I got astigmatism here and you know how it gets crazy in the field, you know, so I always wear my glasses, but it's been really easy and I love this. I love this teleprompter. It's definitely worth the perch. I think I paid 145 on Amazon for it. Definitely worth the perch. 10 out of 10. If you guys enjoyed this video review on this amazing teleprompter, the Padcaster, please smack that like button for me right now. Also, write in the comments below on any other gear you might want me to review. And if you want to see more content like this in the future, as well as Final Cut Pro 10 tutorials and filming tips and tricks, please subscribe to the channel. I want to ignite and help grow this community. And don't forget to ignite. See ya.